Morgan. Well, you don't want to miss your chance to see Willy Wonka Jr. performed by the Penguin Project of the Sauk Valley. The group will be taking the stage at Sterling High School next Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Here with the details is Kaylee Conklin, director of the Sauk Valley Penguin Project, and Caitlin O'Donnell, one of the actors in the show. Ladies, thanks for being here today. Thanks for having us. We're yeah. so excited. Yeah. Thank you so much. Okay, so uh, Kaylee, let's first talk a little bit more about the Penguin Project, what it is, and, and how it all works. Sure. So this is a theater program here in the Sauk Valley area um, for kids with special needs. They come to me in August, and we rehearse for 13 weeks. Wow. I try to give them the same ex theater experience as any high school kid would get. So they audition. Um, they practice, and then what we're going to do next week is go into tech week. So a whole entire week, they come with me for like almost three hours. Busy, tonight. busy. Yes, and then they perform for three shows. Wow. Okay, so you guys work together for a very long time, essentially since the school year begins. Right. Um, and one thing I think is really cool, I was reading about it, is um, all the kids that are part of the show, uh, like Caitlin, they work alongside mentors. Correct. So every actor, so this is Caitlin here, her mentor is not with us, but she has a mentor. Um, her mentor helps her learn her lines, dances, oh. songs, um, anything that she needs to know. They come to practice just as the same as Caitlin does every day. And then when they go on stage, we blend the mentors in. So if Caitlin is like a main person, her mentor could be um, assistant to her. Okay. So then you can't tell. Um, but then her mentor is still able to help feed her lines if she needs them or sing right next to her. Oh, uh, that's awesome. Oh, what are we seeing video? Are we seeing video of da uh, practice right now? Oh, rehearsals? yes. They're doing some kind of dance. Oh, that's Don't Stop Believing. So Don't Stop oh, Believing, every yeah. Penguin Project does. Um, so it's really cool if you're a part of another Penguin Project and come to a show. Mm. You can get up at the end of the show and do the Don't Stop Believing dance with all of us. This is our um, um one of the Oompa Loompa dances that this one here I was in. Okay, so yep. yeah, I was going to ask you. So you guys are performing Willy Wonka, mm -hmm. Caitlin. So what is your role? What are you, what are you? Are you an Oompa Loompa? So I'm in. A, there's five main Oompa Loompas, and I'm Oompa Loompa three. Awesome. And it's like I love being an Oompa Loompa. <laughs> like. I love how like funny and like silly we get to be and yeah. like our costumes are like pretty cool too. I bet they are. <laughs> I really think that's like the Oompa Loompas are one of the most memorable parts I think of Willy Wonka whether it's the movie or it's the musical or anything like that. Um, so I, I love that and how has it been like having like working alongside a partner like one of the, the mentor that helps you um, <laughs> practice and, and all of that. What's that been like? Well. I love having like a mentor like Aww. by me because like if I like don't know like one of my lines or like a song or something then they can help me out like with that and and it's okay because it's supposed to be fun yeah yeah that's awesome um, and uh, Kaylee you have students actually I was reading um, from all over taking part in this I mean some of them do travel uh, quite a ways uh, like up to an hour um, to just be a part of this really special thing yeah so this theater program um, Penguin Project of the Sock Valley is needed I guess. Yes. Um, we have a wait list of people trying to get in. We have dedicated parents and students who drive almost an hour for us, um, a wide range, just to come participate. And it really is something magical. Um, some of the mentors, like Caitlin said, she loves having her mentor with her. Yeah. They become best friends. We give these students a chance and learning skills give them friends, a safe space, so yeah. they can perform theater and learn other things And well. the, the mentors, I don't know if we already mentioned this, because if, if we didn't, I wanted to, they're, they're also students. Correct. So the, you know, they, um, they're being there as well, like what, as young as so junior high? Yep, junior high kids, high school kids, That's amazing. and college kids. So they still can play sports, they still have extracurriculars, they still have homework. Um, but they still show up for me three hours a week for 13 weeks, and it's really amazing. I absolutely love that. Uh, so you guys have been rehearsing for a very long time, as you just mentioned. Um, it sounds like it's going to be a great show. Um, Caitlin, what are you most looking forward to about the performance? What's your favorite part? I really love, like, all the singing and, like, dancing and, like, just 
really being like on stage and like performing is like a wonderful, th wonderful thing to do, and it's like, or also like a wonderful way to like support the Penguin Project of the Sock Valley too. Yeah. yeah. So buy your tickets, right? Yeah. <laughs> so buy <laughs> tickets. No, it's so great to hear what a wonderful experience you've had, Kaylin, and um, you know, Kaylee. There. This has to really make a big impact, not only on the students that are acting and taking part in this, but the mentors and the, the audience. Yeah, the Penguins and their mentors will have you laughing and crying all in one show for an hour and 15 minutes. I promise you, you won't want to miss it. I can imagine, um, yeah, especially when you guys play Don't Stop Believing and everybody starts dancing. That is cool. That's a really special thing that you guys do across all the chapters. Yes. Amazing. Well, performances of Willy Wonka Jr. by the Penguin Project of the Sock Valley are set for November 8th, 9th at 7 p.m. and November 10th at 2 p.m. You can see this show at Sterling High School in the Centennial Auditorium. Auditorium. Tickets are $10 and they can be purchased by heading to centennialauditorium.org or by calling that phone number at the bottom right on your screen. Uh, Kaylee and Caitlin, thank you, thank you for coming on the show today and, and, and making the trip out here to Quad Cities Live. We appreciate it and uh, looking forward to seeing you in the show. Yes, thanks for the opportunity. Yes, thank you.